Yeah, Tabuk Ne Ulogan Amriori. Good morning, everyone. Uh, uh, my topic is about the Aran Hebergan Root Rebellion. Uh, I, I chose this title from the Mantra Archives. Uh, uh, the Chibdunjav, uh, the little brother of the Chungunjav, Chungunjav, and uh, in his uh, memorial to the Qing Empire, Qianlong Empire, uh, in the empire, in the memorial, uh, he called the world people who residing along the Aran Habergan Road rebelled. So I I uh, I followed his his calling that I called this rebellion as Aran Habergan Road rebellion. And I want to introduce this. Uh, where is the Aran Habergan Road? Uh, it's the Aran Habergan Road begin by departing from Barkul Barkul. It is uh, one place in Xinjiang province nowadays, and uh, went along Jungar Basin and uh, passed through the Urumqi, and uh, at, la at last beginning uh, reaching to Ili. This route is called the uh, Aran Road. Uh, sorry, uh, it's not working. It's here. But uh, sorry, it's not much clear. This is a large thing, but I think I can maybe cut to the uh, 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 uh,
uh, in the change of function C to J, it described described the Junkai people as Jacobs and Wolfies, which refers to the Junkai people, cannot be fit as dogs and pigs are, and the Chi Xiao, which is one kind of fire spirit, which also also refers to the Junkai people, cannot be brought up as chickens and ducks are. Such kind of people who like to rebel again and again, even if I let them live longer, they still cannot feel my mercy. And the, the cheaters, the cheater is a reverse Amusana. The cheater was playing tricks there. That's the only thing to do is extinguish them. So it is completely saying that the Junga people extinguish because of they are rebelled again and again. They are so re are rebellious. They deserve like, uh, they deserve this. And however, uh, today I would, I would argue that after the Amersana's rebellion, the empire, the Chelong empire was so resentful that he ignored how the Jungar people were completely impoverished with multitudes, multitudes of people then dying from starvation and even eating human corpses. Even so, the, he, the empire, still ordered the army, which had departed several months from Barakul to advance to sees Amursana by advancing into the Kazakh people, Kazakh step. In order to follow the instruction, the generals, which is the leading army in the Ili Ili, uh, the generals uh, and the commanders uh, took food and supplies from the Junkar people, which was, in fact, it is a form of robbery. And all these actions disappointed the Junkar people deeply and have generated a major invisible contradiction between the newly surrounded Jungars and the Qing government. This is one of the most crucial factors in the occurrence, occurrence of the Rand Bergen Rebellion, which was inspired by Qing Gunjab uh, launching an upheaval, upheaval within the Khalkha Mongols. Uh, I, based on my research and my argument, mainly on this uh, on this resource, resource, which is called a Collection of Xinjiang Manchu Archives in Qing Dynasty. <laughs> and uh, you can, and in my, in, in my paper, uh, our, uh, in my paper, I try to, I try to prove my, uh, about my ancient argument. Uh, all in, in all my papers, which you will see uh, in this book on page 97 to 90, uh, what, what, what? Uh, I don't want to say the details, details of my improvement, but uh, I, I, if you're interested, you can all read all of the, the improvement or evidence I, I taken from this, this uh, mantra archives. And my conclusion is that um, after Capturing the last Jungar Khan Daochi, the Qing central government decided to set up four Khans. Set up, the Qing government wanted, wanted to set up four Khans, but Amrsana wanted to, wanted to be the only, the only Khan of the Jungar people. So, after learning that the Qing government cannot satisfy his, his ambition or his desire, uh, he, he chose to rebel. And, uh, and, uh, uh, in an attempt to seize Amursana, the Qing army once again advanced to, to the Yili, and at this time, the Jungar people, the Jungar upper class people, Taiji and the Jason, who had been uh, endowed with the titles by the big empire at the Dolanur, uh, tried their utmost to conscript soldiers among their subjects in order to have seized Amursana. And uh, meanwhile, the Jungar nomads who were residing along the campaigning route also provided provisions for Qing armor, Qing army. Uh, these all deteriorated the living conditions of the Jungar people. The big empire detached Amrsana. He is hated Amrsana so much. So he ordered the Chiring, Chiring to uh, capture Amrsana. How to capture Amrsana? But Chiring has failed to capture Amrsana. Driven by the shame and the anger, the big empire uh, swore revenge on Amersana and uh, Hilas neglected the numerous Jungar people who were dying each day from starvation. The big empire severely denounced, denounced Chiring that this is the, uh, the, gener gen gen the general. 
who is leading the Qin army, telling that he should not stop since Amrsana had not been captured yet, and the Qin should go to the Kazakh so as to capture Amrsana, forced by the big empire. Qin last compelled the Jungar people to provide compared the Jungar people to provide provision for his army so that he could advance towards Hazar to capture Amrsana. This had indeed deepened, deepened the suffering of the Jungar people and they could not make a living any longer. It had hurt the Jungar people's heart as well and they believed that the big empire merely wanted to capture Amrsana and dismissed the needs of the whole Jungar population uh, who had been long suffering from this. Uh, the Jungar people were so disappointed that they found this they fomented the Aran Habergan Road Rebellion. And uh, 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 I want to uh, talk more about this, uh, about the rebellion. I want to uh, explain how many people and uh, how, big, how big the rebellion is, how many people involved in the rebellion. Uh, actually, I'm not not a cleric, uh, exact, exact number or exact amount, how many people involved in the rebellion, but I can make it clear like uh, Heidi and Jason, it, it is the upper class people uh, of the Jungar people uh, who rebelled against Qing, Qing, who rebelled against the Qing government is a uh, take on proportion of 9.5% among the whole forcible Taiji and Jason of the Jungar. I get this figure from, from the record of the Qing government. Sorry, it's not more clear yet. The name of the Taiji Zhang came to prison and fell in Chelong 20 years and the name of the Taiji and the Zhang who came to prison and fell in the Chelong 20 years. And all the Taiji Zhang's name and belong to which Orthodox and which Adam is regular. And there are so many people. And they, uh, they recorded, at this time, when the Qing Empire uh, conquered the Dungar people, they recorded all the Taijis and the Jaisang's name, who are very forceful, who are very influential in Dungar people. So they, they record all of them, and uh, they also make a record that how many, how many people they have killed during, during, the, uh, uh, during the rebellion. And uh, this is, this is uh, the man killed on the Dungar people. Also, uh, the the enemies of the Jungar Chinese who came to present themselves in the Chinese colonials. So, uh, I I I when I reading the Manchu archives, I I pick out the how many people rebelled and the how many what a proportion they they will take with all these people. So I get the figure uh, mentioned about from this. So today I want to say is uh, what is the relationship between Amersana's rebellion and uh, and the, the Aran Habergan Road rebellion? And I want to say that in the Chinese historical works compiled in the Qing Dynasty, uh, they speak about their own interest and hidden the true true history. Uh, they didn't they didn't uh, rebel. Lots of people re rebelled, but they are forced. They are the respect uh, respect. They are we are we have been. They are the respect, they are, it is neglected uh, for a long time is the Jungar people is in some, in some sense, they are forced to rebel against, against the Jung, uh, Qing government. They are not, 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 because, because to support Amrsana and they choose to rebel. Thank you.
Well, that's um, a very impressive research and also left a lot of time. You actually had many more minutes uh, to speak, but I guess that means that we can have a lot of time for questions. So if you want to, maybe by asking questions, we'll be able to get some of the other points which he might have made in the time. Yes. Okay. Are they in the mountains? Is this mountains? And, and place us in terms of today's boundaries a little bit so we can understand where it is. Oh, sorry, I can't make it the whole point. Right. So I should. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the mountain of Aran Havagan. Aran Havagan. And uh, uh, the Aran Havagan begins from the Ubar, put some kind of character. Ubar is not in it. Ubar is not in it. No, no, it is in uh, Xinjiang province. Yeah, Xinjiang. Xinjiang. Is this a mountain pass? Is it a pass in the mountain? Are they in the mountain? Mm -hmm. On the mountain top? Yeah, this is uh, actually this is a picture of uh, north of Xinjiang province at Xinjiang mm -hmm. at that pass. Yes, and around uh, Havagan is here. This is part of uh, part. And the around Havagan road begins may, maybe. Uh, Barcode is somewhere here, and uh, this is this is Urumqi. This is Urumqi. Urumqi is here now. So it is along this Dungar facing, and uh, go to the Aran Havagan, and go to Ili. Is it the the heavenly mountains? The heavenly mountains of Kunlun? Which oh, no, 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 it's not. It's not the Tenshan may be around here, right? Tenshan is here. Tenshan is here. Yeah, this is the Tenshan. And then north of here is uh, the uh, the a desert, very dry desert. So the rivers flow north into the desert. And uh, this is one route uh, when the Qing army uh, marching marching to the Dili in Qianlong County here. And there is the other way, which is which is uh, let's say the from the Olesse, Olesse and across the Chis River. This is Uh, I'm just gonna kill the life himself. However, I'm just gonna die the life himself. <laughs> that idea, <right? laughs> that he died because of that, uh, because of because of sleep. The smallpox. Mm -hmm. Smallpox. 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 Okay. okay. Translate for her, 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 her question to the other people. Well, ask them also in English. So okay, okay. So <clears throat> maybe, yeah, maybe uh, the empire is considering considering that because uh, the empire has been so kind to Amritsana. 
the, the American is welcomed very kindly, and uh, he dared a uh, rebel against the empire. So he wanted to put, uh, put him down because the other people will follow her, follow him. And uh, mm, mm, there's another reason. Chilling <laughs> So he would, uh, they originally he had been um, asked to seize, Sitting had been asked to uh, take control, uh, to seize, arrest um, Amr Sana, but Amr Sana was able to escape. And they, so you were Nuri So the empire is, is, has been, has been uh, announced that Amr Sana has been captured, but actually yeah, yeah. not. So uh, the empire is shameful. Right. So 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 he has the other chain. You have right. you have said you have captured them, but you are failed. It's not fair. Right. Right. So you have to continue to capture them. Right. 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 So yeah, so you understood. So the 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 question was that he had um, uh, he had captured Amrsana, announced that he had captured uh, Amrsana, but then he escaped, and therefore it was a loss of face for the empire. So all of this is not mentioned. Although oh, there is a lot of Memorials uh, by, by Chiring to write to the Qing Empire that people are dying, so suffering so much. We don't have uh, much provisions, we don't have much supplies to go to Hazar to capture Amersana. But the, uh, the Amersana don't, don't receive the, the request. They ask Chiring how to go to the Hazar and the Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. A mini so, uh, translate the question. So first, he asked about there's a, a song called Sixty White Horses," uh, and in this song, it was it's a it's a dialogue sort of song, a traditional folk song, in which somebody uh, uh, goes to the somewhere from the Zungars goes back to the Zungar land, had been away, and asks them, "Where are the people? Where are the horses? Where is everything? What happened to them all?" And so the uh, questioner asked, "Is this? Do you know about this folk song? Was this?" Song after the Iran Habergan rebellion or Amr Sana's rebellion, what's the connection with the, those episodes? Uh, okay. Okay. He doesn't know about this song particularly, but he was um, uh, thinks that it probably it could well be from after the the Iran Habergan rebellion because this after this period there was a lot of slaughter uh, as so many people out of two hundred thousand or maybe uh, uh, six uh, uh, sixty hundreds were uh, remaining so six thousand remaining so uh, so much were were wiped out so it would be appropriate to uh, follow that episode.
I want to say that Ping Ding Shuo Fang Rai at stopped, stopped until Gao Dan is putting down. So there is no much relation between uh, uh, there is no much information included in Ping Ding Shuo Fang Rai about this rebellion, about this Grand American Road rebellion. Yeah, time is different. They are separated, different times. About 50 years earlier. <laughs> right. Ah, uh, okay. So I, I didn't got you on point. Uh, what do you want to ask me? Uh -huh. mm. 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 Yerl Garl Bolot, Mongol Turn Putich, Mongol Turn on Chalikin Talar Bolot, Bitney, El Gahot Bolot, Mash Taked V. Potich, when Watching the Bolot, Mongol Nutni and Dril, Mongol Turn Putich in Talar Bolot, Mash, Sekana, Tursil Bitsimbena. Coach P. Bolot and Mini Botarbol and Mini Nutrin Yere, Pitga Yilkolin Doha, in whom you were Bolgar Gagasan, you and Tigad in your Hitel Sindoha, Mini Yasnas, Yimshta Nerin Jul Pitsumbo, the Tertigil Sanakitan. Many years and only during years and you just near Julian and Tatra Jorgels and Gosh and Agrijan. Which many which are terrible Mongol, Mongol, Mongol hand turn with us, which Mongol to keep its men. His Malahara knee, Mongol and Turn Putich, Turn on Chalik, on Chilim Balbuldra, Mongol Turbalbula, Mongol Nutich and Amog and Holbog with the Im Hachas Walbul, Mongol to Mongol to Mongol to keep the city of Mongol, Mini Water, Pitin, Mongol and Tokai to Kail, or to stay with it. So he hadn't read the whole book. The, um, um, uh, Ortolung asked about a book by a Jap Last Nomad Empire by a Japanese uh, scholar. Asked how useful is this book, and um, uh, Amlung's response was that he hasn't read the whole thing, but he's read parts of it, and he feels, from that point of view, it's very, it's a very useful book for talking about some of the distinctive characteristics of uh, the nomadic state, the nomadic state structure. But uh, it's not, doesn't give the same kinds of detailed uh, type of study such as he, I've been able, I've been able to do from, he's been able to do from the documents. So uh, on the question of the sort of distinctive characteristics of nomadic states and civilizations, it's, it's useful, but it's not that detailed. Time for one or two more questions, or yes. Uh Uh, um, 
Bi balbal ertam balbal in jungarn hamate ugulal bistim balkar balbal in jungarn manch tangsin atras jungarn hamate sorak chang kiki balbal anchile na har chursim. Tikta nishte in jungari thushtam uskur oska teelin dagolok teen do andam balu manchin chang jungar handa mul mash nirn doctor ke yu hiwa bitkom utur balgan uskur chak doctor muduluk chokal dia balkar manchin dang solbon mash chokal uskur hamuk chokal bear serte gich in thakhe dam balbal. So I would like to think that the Manchu records are actually the most important because in the process of suppressing the Zunga rebellion and pacifying them, they really kept very detailed records down to the hour, hour by hour records of what they were, where they were and what they were doing. So I think the Manchu records are in fact the most valuable. Uh, Chokan she corrected on what you know, who is well with Timmy Muddi Tizungo, with Sun Munch, Hazak Totaradi Sumo School, Uno Dunolo So the um, other materials, there's clear script materials written by the Zunga Oirats themselves. Unfortunately, very few of them have remained. Many of them fled to the ones who survived, fled to the Kazakhs. Um, there's a small number of them kept in the Hilly Valley, uh, but not much. Good. So I, I don't actually know Russian, so Russian materials is not something I understand very well, but I don't think actually that there is the same degree of detail in the Russian archives as there are in the Manchu archives. That's the second. It is the second question now, and the first question. That was that was the first question. Um, so whether, what do you mean by within these questions of historiography? Yeah. Yammer Tazur Tabasin Bay, Gijasogat, Tur Ata Tene Tazur, Orton Bison Tazur of Yammer Yagatawe. Octam Volbun in in Urun Avergan and since the Jungarit which took Talaki Volbul, Uk Uk Nevru Volbur, Ching was in Talpega, Till Ching was Volbul Kalto, Hat Tap TM, other Sena, your center pinging Jungar, Fangle, and Muskul Ching, Fangu Shi, Tujum Mutin. Uh, Token <laughs> Uh, <laughs> So it, previously, as, as, he talked, as I talked about previously, the point of view has been based on these two works, uh, Jungar Pingding, uh, 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 Pingding Jungar Fanghui and the other Huang Chao, I forgot the name of it. Um, so that one, that basis was based on the, uh, from that point of view, people got the idea that there, sort of, there was some sort of, the Jungars were just kind of rebellious and evil, had to be suppressed. But from my research, I was able to find out how personal it was and um, the, how it was uh, uh, being uh, influenced by the personal considerations of the emperor. I think we, this is so. Our next paper, thank you very much. Thank you.